this video. Thanks for clicking on it. And sorry if you hear random noises in the background because my friend is texting me and I will try to ignore it. And I hope you do too, but sorry about that. So this video is me ranting about someone and I'm not going to use their name. So let's call them Pillow because I have a pillow right in front of me because I'm saying right next to my bed. So I clearly see a pillow because everybody has pillows on their bed. But beyond that topic. So, um, we have resources in my school, which is basically a block where we don't, we're supposed to do homework and read and our teachers give us assignments. Like say if you missed a test, you would do it in resource. Well, what happens in resource is not a lot of times we actually get stuff done and we are allowed to go and help teachers and you know go to the library and whatnot so we go um in our school there's a music uh there's a room and um we help clean that room up in during our resource block my friend fernanda and caleb and pillow well pillow decides that he's gonna it's a band room um, so there's obviously, you know, like a tuba and a trombone and band instruments because it's clearly a band room. So apparently he played a band instrument before. And so what he does is he picks up the tuba and starts blowing in it, which, okay, you randomly pick up this tuba that clearly doesn't belong to you. And it's a mouthpiece. You blow into a mouthpiece that other people have blown into. First, my germaphobe, like me, the germaphobe, is like crying out like, no, 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 that's really gross. You can at least clean it first, you know, wipe it off with the sleeve of your, of your shirt. At least be somewhat decent about it. But then, the band room is like, if the band room's here, the front office, where the principal, the secretary, the two vice principals, and everybody important in our school, it's like right there. It's literally like, 10 feet away, 5 feet away, and a tuba, if you haven't heard one, which you probably did, is really, really loud, and it's deep, and it's just sending vibrations in the room. So you, it feels like everything's shaking. It's really loud. And then the front office is right there. We don't want to get yelled at for making too much noise because Pillow decided he wanted to play a tuba. So there is kind of an extension on that room, and it's a practice room for the people who are band, orchestra, choir, or guitar. So we go to clean that up because we finished the band room. Well, Pillow decides to, oh, let's, uh, I'm going to go along too. Let me annoy these pe people. So there's um, two other people in the band, uh, in the practice room. So the person, there is one person cleaning up, you know, organizing music. And then the second person is practicing his clarinet, which is totally normal. No problem with that. But Pillow decides he's going to pick up the trombone. So he's just sitting there blaring on the trombone. And my friend Caleb's like, Seth, seriously, stop. And Sasha's like, Seth, you really got to stop. You're going to hear it from the front office. And I'm just standing there, I'm like, <sighs> Aaron, don't punch someone, don't get upset, because it was like, like, do you really need someone to tell you five times to stop doing something? Like, are you that immature? Like, really, that's not necessary, and you really shouldn't do that. Like, at least have the respect to, and courtesy to other people, and at least stop playing on the instrument. Or even not, okay, you want to annoy us? That's fine. At least have the courtesy the to the person who's practicing. Yeah. So now, thank you for watching. That was me having a rant on pillow. <sighs> Deep breaths. Well, bye. Mwah.